What's going on, everyone? It's me, Ramily Dammily Diddly Doodler, Alex the Rambler here, and today we're once again on the Great Kerfuffle mod for Hearts of Iron 4. We're going to be continuing the campaign that I started as France, uh, which was just ended in a stalemate for that particular video. But just before we begin, we do have a sponsor for today's video. Wee -wee! Many thanks to Honey for sponsoring today's video. If you don't know what Honey is, it's a free browser extension that scours the internet for promo codes and automatically tests them when you're checking out. All right, so let's say I, have, I wanted to get an early start on my Christmas shopping and I wanted to use Honey to try and find myself uh, a little bit of a discount on some lovely chocolat. All you have to do is once you're at the checkout, Honey, we'll search for codes and let's see if we can save some money. I've just saved £10. <laughs> hey! Chocolate for Alex! I mean, for family. <laughs> so those of you that have already installed Honey using my link have found over $2,000 in savings. That's a lot of savings. So all you need to do is go to joinhoney.com slash alextherambler and it's extremely simple to install. It's free and uses whatever browser you have and it's just a way to save money. Why wouldn't you use it? I don't know. <laughs> uh, sponsors such as Honey do really help out the channel as well so if you want to support me uh, by supporting uh, the channel just, just click on the link and install Honey. Thank you very much. That's joy. And thanks, Honey, for sponsoring today's video. Maybe if Honey was around uh, back in the day, Germany's economy wouldn't have completely tanked. No, that, does that make sense? I don't think that makes... I'm not a financial advisor, but I've saved money with Honey. Oh, that rhymes. Anyway, this is the state of the game where we left off. As you can see, it, it's, just a, it's just a big old clump. Like, I managed to push into Germany a little bit, um, but the, I, I, I can't push anymore. I was up here, that's failing. Russia capitulated and is now the Soviets. And then we also have uh, Bulgaria and the Ottomans um, keeping the Allies pinned down in Albania and Greece. So it's a bit of a mess. I don't know how long this is going to continue, but this is going to be a scenario of what if World War you didn't end. Oh my god, my units are out of equipment too. What am I lacking? Guns. Brilliant. But, if you want to see more Hearts of Iron and potentially more multi-part series, uh, just comment, like, and subscribe. It'd be amazing if this video could get to 5,000 likes, and we'll just jump straight into the video. So this was the state of it. I managed to push forward, push through, towards uh, Frankfurt. Um, Frankfurt? But we're, we're stuck. Uh, the Allies, the rest of the Allies, are stuck down here in Bulgaria. It's just, it's just a massive slog. At least it's going to be a slog. Uh, I'm going to try and hold Germany for as long as possible. Uh, we might get pushed back. Germany, I think, has a lot of manpower. One million manpower in reserve. Um, we are taking attrition. Pourquoi? So apparently, one thing a lot of you were saying is that I'm lacking heavy artillery in my divisions. I didn't realise that they were important to, to, to make. So I guess I'll try and go for the heavy artillery strat. Um, having aerial superiority hasn't helped me, so I guess I'll take some off plans, some off motorized, and we go full on in, trying to get me some of them. There we go. So this is this is a scenario which I guess could have been predicted. Oh no! Oh yeah, I was trying to get out of here completely, wasn't I? This isn't going well at all. So if most of the Frenchies can get out, that's okay. I'm just going to try and get them out of there, so they'll leave when they're able to, in theory. Um, we are holding them here a little bit. I probably need to increase the infrastructure in these here parts. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I am unable to push. It's that's just the, that's the three hours. Oh, well, farewell, almost one hundred thousand Frenchmen. Yeah, the, the central powers are strong, and the Anton literally have no supply. Oh, they've overstacked. They've overstacked so much. One division made it out of there out of fifteen. That was a terrible Dunkirk. If you're wondering, like, how did how did the world get into this situation? Check out the first part over on the channel. <laughs> German aggression has acquired proportions hitherto unprecedented in history. France is now at a crossroads of history, and this kerfuffle will either glorify us or bury our past. Every Frenchman understands this. Il ne pas front pas. If only we'd have had that a little while ago, then we might not have died down there. But cool. 
Oh my god, I don't even have support weapons for 1917. What was I doing at the end of this? Uh, but yeah, it looks like the Ottomans are under a lot of pressure. So, uh, never mind, they're still, they're still holding in most of their areas. Yeah, I'm actually really surprised at how well they've done. What's going on down here? Belgium? Why don't you get back up to the, the front? I have heavy tanks. Surely I can take Strasbourg with four units of heavy tanks. They're not amazing, but I, you'd think they'd be able to do all right. Give them some support howitzers and everything. This is only defended by cavalry. Okay, bam. Oh my god, we're winning. Come on, tanks. And I have aerial superiority. Oh, sacre bleu. Sacre bleu. Come on, thrust forward. Oh no, they're running out of org. They're de-orging my tanks. Push! Oh my god, we did it. The tanks kind of work. Being attacked from all sides, including four heavy tank divisions. Can we do it, ladies and gents? Push! Come on, lad! Come on! Oh my god, this might be the first encirclement of the day. Oh, baby! Nice. We did it. Ah, oh, what a thrill ride, eh? We are securing our push into Germany in 1919. Now hold the phone here. That's just two Bulgarian units. Oh my god. Could you imagine if this is when we actually really start to push Germany? I should have just been patient. This scenario might be over in half an hour. Shortest Toy 4 video ever. Bam, then bam, then bam. Use the infantry to assist you. Push! Push! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now, UK? What is your problem? That the tanks are slowly starting to push. I don't believe it. Through a forest tile, no less. Doing. Oh, they're de -orged. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, this is a thrill ride, isn't it? This is as fast as combat goes in World War One. Wow. Oh, they're reinforced. Sacre bleu. Sacre bleu, mon ami. Oh, no. No, fall back. Oh god. Okay, I stretched myself too far. Okay, then the Germans immediately counter-attack me. And they couldn't actually encircle all of my tanks here. They could encircle all of the tanks. Do not encircle all of my tanks, please. Please. Come on now. Oh, for pity's sake. They pushed us back across the river. If anywhere's gonna fall, it might be Austria-Hungary, but oh my god. Look at how many divisions could be encircled if they just take this time. That's horrifying. That's horrifying. Absolutely horrifying. What is going on? What is going on? Come on! So that some divisions they only have like one tile, uh, one one or two units, but that's still not enough for me to push. <laughs> that's the depressing thing. Okay, here we go. Another naval invasion. Do 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 do. Ba 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 then, before they can, like, go off, I'll try for another failed one. push. Try and encircle them in Cologne. No, then, yep. There we go. Just to give our troops time to keep pushing. Come on, land! Land! Oh, sacre bleu. Sacre bleu, no! They've decrypted me. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. The tanks are moving! We've encircled four units. How on earth are they travelling? How did they escape? Are you are you having an a Attention. actual giraffe? This is like uh, just French general loses his mind in World War One, really, isn't it? I am getting some howitzer divisions out. Just 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 bear with me. How do they have 843 defense, but my units only have 38 soft attack? I don't understand. My tank isn't even reinforcing in the battle. Oh yes, it is. But its defense is 160. It's a heavy tank. It's a heavy tank. I don't I'm understand. Sure. I'm legitimately confused. I clearly don't understand the game well enough anymore. I just don't understand the meta of World War One. apparently. Even though I thought I did. Why are we suddenly getting forced back? What is the supply? Oh, for God's sake. Is it just down to the supply? And my units have been encircled. I can't stop the German Blitzkrieg, apparently. They're all dead. They're all going to die. Brilliant. I am shocked just at how that complete... Oh my god, my army's falling apart. Germany's pushing me back. My grand army is getting crushed. Oh, jeez. I've completely lost this front. No, they won't get encircled because Belgium is on my side at least. So how is this happening? How is this happening? How are the Germans... How are the Germans not... 
I need everything you can give me. This is horrifying. How are the Allies doing? Okay. Japan is on my side, yes? At least I thought they were. They are in the Entente. Good. Germany still managed to hold on to frickin' Africa. Let's see if my divisions with howitzers in can do anything. They appear to be better. That's for sure. Oh my god, the howitzer strat. The howitzer strat. It's so powerful. Oh, full attack. Full attack. Howitzers with tanks. That's what you needed. And now it's now it's falling apart, everyone. No, just keep going. Just keep going. Just keep going. Just spread your wings and fly, my dudes. You look, you caused a freaking breach, guys. That's when you keep going. That's when you keep going. You keep going. Support the attack with everything we have. Oh, fuck! I have the first advance, the first real push that I do in freaking ever. And then I have an army epidemic. So we kind of need to stop pushing now. Brilliant. Epidemics. You, you gotta love them, haven't you? No. Ich bin ein annoyed. Then we push on to Frankfurt. No longer have the influenza. You have makeshift bridges, don't you, General? Did it work? Did we do it? Why did you stop attacking? Huh? Come on. Push. I feel like that that, that is the entire video. Push. 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 Okay, World War I, 1920, still in a freaking stalemate. I don't I don't believe it. I actually don't believe it. This is just horrible. This is horrible. No one should ever. Wars are dumb. Election of 1920. And he's a lunatic. Why do we have a lunatic leading France? Come on. And my agent's killed again. For pity's sake. Oh, they're counterattacking again. They're counterattacking again. Oh, lordy. Now, my tank and howitzer divisions, I'm, I'm hoping they can get across the bridge. I am lacking tanks. I'm lacking trucks, too. Well, we'll go and we'll see. I'll give them more time to plan. Makeshift bridges. Oh, they can just reinforce so quickly. I, I don't know what to do anymore. This is with howitzers. This is with howitzer divisions. Tanks are useless. Tanks are... Tank, 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 tank. Tanks are... I don't know what to do. I'm so confused now. This is like the never-ending war of nightmares. That's all this is. Maybe I should have built some zeppelins and just bombed them to heck. I've pretty much built a factory on every freaking tile I can. I Oh my god, I have so much of Africa. I bet you've never seen a scenario like this where World War One has gone on this long. Screw kerfuffle. We're getting serious now. Seriously exasperated. <laughs> Peace? Peace? <laughs> Oh, Philip Patan is wounded. Boo-hoo. Oh, piss off, mate. Mass desertion? Uh, like, there's no story to this scenario. It's just World War One is never-ending for me. And I hate it. Like, it's just... This is just awful. But I have managed to invade up here without Germany doing anything, which is quite nice. Oh, they're bringing Ukraine. Screw you, Ukraine. I'm coming for you. And I've got 40 combat with howitzers. Send in the air! Come on, howitzers. You can do it. Not enough troops are coming off that border to really make much of a difference though. And how much attrition am I taking? Lots. So, what do we do? We build naval bases. <laughs> Everywhere. Give me supply. Take Hamburg. I am very overstretched with my supply. No! Stop pushing me back. I have 40 combat with 40 combat with howitzer divisions. What is happening? They're holding, kind of. When a division loses a tile, they immediately try and take it back, which is just which is just a really stupid idea. Oh boy, this is just this has gone horribly. Again. Well Bye. Oh dear. See how much do three divisions? How much supply do they need? Nineteen and they have two. How does a massive port like Hamburg only get they don't have Hamburg? Why are these divisions using so much supply? <sighs> Now, as unlike Lily as it is, I'm going to try and get my howitzers. Maybe push through where Austria-Hungary is weak. It's maybe something I can do, but yeah, the attrition is crazy. One division, no equipment. 114 defense, eight soft attack. Eight divisions can't take out one under a, a division that has no equipment. Oh my god, they did it. I think it's just cost everything in terms of equipment, because there's just no supply. And then they just reinforce into other tiles, so it's pointless. I'm going to try and invade the Ottomans. Try and seize control. 
of Egypt. There we go. That's something I can try and do while the rest of my division slowly get equipped or just attrition to hell. Because if we can make an encircle like the Ottoman state collapse, that's a nice boon in 1921, right? I am lacking 5,000 pieces of artillery though. I made a bit of uh, progress for the Allies here at least. So maybe they'll be able to encircle that one tiny division. All right, let's get some intel on the old Ottomans. Let us commence the naval invasion. See, I'm taking, I'm taking attrition there. Attrition is such an issue for these divisions. I think most of my divisions have probably died to attrition. We go. I've helped the Allies strike against the Got Ottoman more. Empire. We must now take more ports. Attention. Please, more supply. Everyone needs more supply. I especially do. All right, let's let's Continue retreat. Let's get out. Goodbye. Now the Allies can cover it. The rest of their bazillion troops. 119 supply. That's what they need. Oh my god. But at least I opened up a new front. To an extent. Right. Are the Allies already losing again? Bruh. And they're just going to attrition to death. Oh wow. My units just melt. Absolutely melt. 875 defense. And they melt. Still oversupply here. But at least these ones aren't melting as much. Still uh, oversupply. What do I do? Sacre bleu. Son? What would happen if I did this? An absolute slaughter on my end, yes? Oh yes. So we can actually do stuff sometimes. That it just occupies more German troops. Still can't really do much. Like, if I wanted to be cheeky and be like, Haha, it's me. Like, you just can't do it. I've got a ton of soft attack though, but they've got more defense and soft attack against me. Bam! And they stop attacking. They just lose org instantly. I'm still at the same point at the start of this video, aren't I? Oh no, never mind. The Ottomans actually managed to take back all the stuff I gained for the Allies. I'm loving it, loving it, loving it. I'm loving it like that. <laughs> I'm not loving it. Do, 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 do. It's horrifying. They don't have a port yet though. So if I could just, like, naval invade in here and go bloop, then that might be nice. Oh, paratroopers. Uh, maybe I can just try and paradrop every city. That That's going to be my new aim. Just paradrop everyone. <laughs> That'll just screw with their... I'm hoping their garrisons or their other units, and then I can just be like, bam, I'm going to push. Uh, but yeah, I should be able to encircle this, I think. Should have just done that from the start, really. I will finish this war. I give you my word. Doing, mother truckers. It's me, France. What are you going to do when I encircle you? Nothing. Now please run out of supply because I already am. Oh my god. No, no, no. Don't come in. Don't come in, please. Oh, they're, they're about to lose Alexandria. I can at least hold on to this. You know when you um, sometimes regret helping your allies? This is one of those days. Have I taken so much attrition now I can't even move my... Oh no, they are moving. Very slowly. Can I reverse Uno the Ottomans? Probably not. I don't understand how the Ottomans have so many... They all have... They, they don't actually have that many divisions by the looks of it. We have 8 million manpower fielded against their 3 million. Okay, how many paratroopers can I get? A lot, apparently. Lovely. 50 paratrooper divisions. I'm going to wreak havoc. Oh, that's how I could win this. Just sacrifice tons of paratroopers to win. That's what you got to do. Hey, I took it. Now you should wait for them to starve. Oh, they took Tel Aviv too. Nice. We shall never surrender. Indeed, Winston. I think that's someone that bought something from one of my stores, I guess. Store links. Okay, somehow they still have supply here. Um, not sure how. They don't have a port. Are they getting supply through the strait? Sorry, I know this probably hasn't been the most exciting video to watch. But honestly, like, my brain is is very confused at this point but here we go 50 paratroopers let's let's <laughs> time lapse me set this up jeez I'm louise sure. well to those who are about to die um i salute you i guess this is going to go awfully but i will just keep doing it and repeating it until it works how's that sunny Oh, 18 in one tile. Oh dear. Just uh, spread yourselves while you while you can walk. 
They still haven't withdrawn too many troops from their borders. That's annoying. I can still try for a little push, I guess. Wilhelm II asks for peace. I think I'm going to do it. <laughs> the Armistice in Compiègne, 1922. Finally, the war is over. And now the winners. A German state will survive, but little else is certain. Good. Okay, so we took enough territory from him to be like, yeah, I'm noping out. Oh. Oh, an armistice. Oh, all of that. Like, how many millions have died? Eight million, five million. Oh, boy. There's an armistice. Can we stop Stop attacking me? Stop attacking me, or I'll continue to attack you. Don't think I won't. I think you just need to wait for the old computing me, Bobby. Oh, but look down here. We actually did a fairly good job at screwing the Ottomans a little bit. Look, they're flooding in, in the Levant. So about that armistice, eh? The German Empire wiped peace France. D why aren't I getting... Oh, I presume there'll be more events. Please? I want Strasbourg. Okay, he's abdicated. Austria-Hungary's all been split up. And now it's the Weimar Republic, led by Friedrich Erbert. Why didn't I have a say in any of this? Excuse me? Ah, the Versailles Conference. Here we go. Collapse of Austria-Hungary. Goodbye! Hold up. What you doing there, Bulgaria? Oh, okay, well... Civil War in Hungary... But, give me Alsace-Lorraine. Oh, 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 oh. oh, wow. Okay, that's grim. Look at all of them. <laughs> oh, dear. There's Kingdom of Serbs, Croats, and Slovenes. Then you got my stuff. Look at that. Mm. Tasty. Tasty indeed. And that, ladies and gents, is where I'll call it. I managed to finish the war. It took me till 1923, but we did it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, of course, if you enjoyed the video, do comment, like, subscribe. Thanks to Honey again for sponsoring the video, and I'll be back very soon. Toodaloo! Many thanks to Onion Duck, Seth Cutter Sturbic, Maximilian Foreman, Wyatt Green, Zachariah Mosby, Tad House, Cobby Was Taken, Matt Zoove, Vash, Warren P. George, Dave D.Y. The Don, Valhalla Halls, Yeah Boy, Ryan Cock, Jack Troku, Jiggly Crotch, Use Beef, Sean Young, and Logan Whaley for being ridiculous random supporters on Patreon, and many thanks to all the other patrons too!